Hey, Zig, who's up next with a super science question? Oh, glad you asked, Zig, because it's Amy, Kiva, and Arthur from School Mockalogue, Limerick. Cool. <laughs> hey, Zig and Zag, we've got a question for you. Are electric eels really electric? What a shocking question. <laughs> anyway, the answer is... No, 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 wait. Let me guess. They're called electric eels because when the yeah. fish of the ocean put together a rock band, what? it was the eel that chose to play the electric guitar. Okay, interesting theory, Zig. Not finished yet. Oh. So there's the octopus on drums. Oh. The mackerel on bass. And the starfish naturally became the singer. Well, I mean, they are stars already, so I mean, it makes Yeah, and to complete the band, right, that's where our good friend the eel came in on electric guitar. And that's where he got the nickname Electric Eel. Mm. Right, but that doesn't answer the question, are electric eels really electric? Well, they can be a little mm? bit. Mm? Like if, say, if they were playing a rock and show concert the night before huh? and you shook their tail the next morning, you might get a little shock left over from their axe shredding the night before. Okay, Zig. Interesting theory, but completely wrong. Oh, You what? see, people have been investigating this to find out the actual scientific answer, and it is that electric eels are actually electric. Fact! Oh, what? It's amazing, really. Get this, right? Yeah. Eels have three sets of organs that actually produce electricity. Whoa. These organs are made of cells called electrocytes. Yeah. Which allow the eel to create both high and low voltage charges. Whoa. Yeah. Eels can vary the shocks, get this, yeah. using low voltage attacks for hunting. Yeah. And higher voltage for self-defense. <laughs> And when threatened, electric eels can produce intermittent electric shocks for an hour without getting tired. What? That's totally rock and show! <laughs> yes, indeed! <laughs> I hope that's answered your question, Amy, Quiva and Arthur. And if you or your class want to investigate the science behind all of your whys, then why not check out ESBScienceBlast.com! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> rock and show, I get it now. Very clever, Zig. <laughs> what? You've no idea, do you? Huh? <sighs>